Hey guys, Melissa Bennett here with the Blue Coast team and eXp Realty of Canada. Our team hopes your Canada Day was as fantastic as ours. So today, let's jump into the June 2021 housing market update for Sarnia Lambton. June had 374 listings active and 191 sold, totaling just above $96 million in sales volume. Compare this to June 2020, where we had 197 sold homes that totaled just above $74 million. June had an average of 14 days to sell versus last June, where it took an average of 24 days to sell. The average sale price was around $513,000 versus $385,000 in June 2020, which is a 33% increase. 34% of those sold were in the $200,000 to $400,000 price range, and the average listing price was $493,000. Now let's look at the different areas of Sarnia individually. Point Edward had three homes sold, having an average sale price of $331,000, and it has one active listing. College Park had three homes sold for an average of $594,000, and there is one active listing. Sherwood Village saw eight homes sold, and they had an average sale price of $493,000, and there are two active listings. Heritage Park had two homes sold, having an average sale price of $600,000, $153,000 and there are 10 active listings. Coronation Park and the Tree Street area of Sarnia had eight homes sold at an average sale price of $381,000 and there are three active listings. Cardiff Acres had four homes sold, having an average sale price of $312,000, and there are currently three active listings. Guthrie Park had eight homes sold, having an average sale price of $480,000, and there are no current listings. High Park had two homes sold, averaging $357,000, and there are no active listings. Sarnia's Northgate area saw seven homes sold, having an average sale price of $378,000, and there are six active listings right now. Downtown Sarnia, including condos, saw seven properties sold, having an average sale price of $431,000, and there are five active listings. Mitten Village saw six homes sold, and their average sale price was $310,000, and there are three active listings currently. South Sarnia had 10 homes sold, having an average sale price of $277,000, and you'll find five active listings there right now. The Rapids Parkway saw two homes sold, having an average sale price of $803,000, and there are two active listings. Twin Lakes had two homes sold, having an average sale price of $681,000, and you'll find four active listings there. Wiltshire saw six homes sold, having an average sale price of $550,000, and there are three active listings. Woodland Park and Oak Acres had nine homes sold, having an average sale price of $500,000, and there are seven active listings. Woodrow Beach and Oak Acres Corners had nine homes sold, having an average sale price of $835,000, and there are six active listings. The Blackwell area of Sarnia had three homes sold, having an average sale price of $610,000, and there's one active listing. Brights Grove saw seven homes sold, having a sale price of $720,000, and there are six active listings. Plimpton, Wyoming saw 17 homes sold, with their average price being $900,000, and there are eight active listings. St. Clair Township saw 29 homes sold, having an average sale price of $430,000, and there are 21 active listings. Thanks for checking out the June 2021 housing market. This is Melissa Bennett, and it's time to come home to the Blue Coast.